SEMARF WAYNE MOLLEN IS A NEWCOMER TO OKLAHOMA POLITICS AND HE'S TRYING TO TURN DISTRICT 2 RED IN NOVEMBER. 2 NEWS REPORTER LIZ BRYANT IS LIVE WITH REACTION FROM THE MULLEN CAMP IN CLAREMORE TONIGHT. LIZ? Karen, we're here at the Will Rogers Museum in Claremore, and just about an hour ago in this packed room, Mark Wayne Mullen gave his acceptance speech. Now, most of the night, you were just had about a 5% of the lead, uh, 5 lead, but you never trailed your opponent. Yeah, we were excited about that. It was humbling uh, to see how people came out and voted for us. You know, they had to take time away from their busy schedule. Everybody's back in school, and still our voters and our supporters turned out and voted, and that's just a great thing. Now, this is your first political race. You are kind of green as as a candidate. However, in a way, you say that's a good thing. Well, absolutely, it's a good thing. I mean, for some reason, we think political experience is what's required, but it's about life experience. Do you know our issues? If you don't know our issues, you're going to have to get familiar with our issues. We're going to have to tell you our issues. That's not what a representative is supposed to be. A representative is supposed to go up there, understand what we're trying to get accomplished, and go up there and represent our people. Beating out a six term state representative, we all want to know has George Fott called yet? Uh, no, we haven't received a phone call, and you know I know he's busy. Uh, he's with his family, he's with his supporters, and we wish him the best of luck. Uh, you know we don't we don't wish anybody any ill will. He's he's got a big big day ahead of him tomorrow too. Mark Wayne, congratulations, and he really says that for the next uh, few weeks, about ten weeks until November, he is going to keep his political campaign on the forefront. Live in Claremore, Liz Bryant, Two News works for you.